Mommy is always there for you. Princess Madeline met with Queen Sylvia. The crisis with Chris refuses to settle, it's been a messy summer for Princess Madeline, 41. The idea was that she and her husband, 49-year-old Chris O'Neill, would spend a big vacation in Sweden and then return to Florida to pack the last of their belongings. They would then return to Stockholm at the end of August and settle down near the court stables near Nyberplan. However, a couple of weeks later, a sudden court announcement was made in Sweden, there would be no move to Sweden, the court questioned and angered the information manager, 60-year-old Margarita Torgren, who announced that the move from Florida had been postponed for a year. When the information manager, who used to work in a slaughterhouse, came up with an explanation, it was hard not to laugh. It's a funny excuse. Torgren claims the couple's move has been postponed due to lack of time. A completely ridiculous excuse. There are many qualified staff at court who can help the princesses with the move, and the foreign office can also support with consular matters. Princess Madeline had problems with her visa to the U.S. a couple of years ago, and then the foreign office swooped in and arranged everything. I in fact, it was Chris O'Neill who stopped the move to Sweden, and we can't expect the couple to arrive next year. Hovind is vague on the issue and has not promised a move to Stockholm, that's because Margarita Torgren knows how dishonest Chris O'Neill can be. The American is angry, frustrated and pissed off as soon as he is seen in public, and according to Stapa Prasarna, Princess Madeline is very tired of her husband. Don't be surprised if Princess Madeline returns to Sweden at the same time that it is announced that Chris will have a long commute, it will be the first step before the inevitable divorce. The years in Florida have been hard on her. Madeline is socially isolated and barely socializes. Before her marriage, Princess Madeline was cheerful and life-affirming. Her beleaguered husband humiliated Madeline, who no longer exudes her former radiance. The princess is having a very difficult time, but fortunately she has a commitment to the Children's Foundation. Madeline has been honorary vice chairwoman of childhood, the charity founded by 79-year-old Queen Sylvia, for nearly two years. Provided from Miami The idea is that the princess will take on the role of Sylvia in the future, something the queen herself has talked about. Madeline is very close to her mother, and they recently met up with Chris after all the touring. The Childhood Foundation convened their international board meeting and thanks to digital technology, Princess Madeline was able to attend from Miami. That's right, Princess Madeline attended the meeting together with the Queen, court information manager Margarita Torgren tells Svensk Damdidning. Princess Madeline herself spoke about her future role in an organization that does so much good for children in difficult situations. It's not an easy task, but I will do my best, she said when she got the job.